Whew. TGIF, guys. What a terribly long day. I swear if I didn't walk 40 laps around the hospital today, I didn't walk any. Long day. Dad had to have a stress test. He was supposed to have one yesterday. And he went to the hospital to have it done. It was a nuclear one. I don't know why the light just doesn't shine. Anyway, he was there to have it. And supposedly they give him a piece of paper, which they did. Well, not supposedly. I don't even know why I said supposedly. But they give him a piece of paper telling him that he couldn't eat 12 hours or drink before. Well, what does he do? He gets up that morning before he goes and drinks a whole full 12 cup pot of coffee and he wasn't supposed to have caffeine so anyway he goes in does part of a test and they tell him that because he drank caffeine that he couldn't have the test done and he had to come back today so again we'll go back to the hospital well they had to do the whole thing over what they did yesterday they had to do it all over took forever we was there early in the morning we didn't get out till after two we got home like three o'clock we was there all day <sighs> anyway he had stress tests and then he was feeling bad and he was upset because he hadn't ate and they had to give him a tray and i don't know it was just dad's a drama queen but um yeah anyway Anyway, I've decided I'm not getting up out of this bed. <laughs> I am not. Unless I have to go to the bathroom, I'm not getting up. I'm tired. My feet hurt. I just don't. I'm just over this whole day. <sighs> Went to the cafeteria in the hospital, and I got a salad, and... No. Never again. Oh, my goodness. Like, I don't know what it was, but everything just tasted like chemically and rancid. And then, um, yeah, so, there was that, so, that was nice. <laughs> and, um, I don't know, I was going, I needed to go to Walmart. I wanted to go to Food City. I did go to Food City, um, because they were having a sale. I don't remember everything they had on sale, because I was trying to mad dash it, just to get a few things so I could get home, um, because I was tired, and it's Friday, and I just, like, I had to miss a day's work today, which, um, I hate, but at the same time, it just, I, what do you do? I have so many things right now that I've got to do on my plate, like, the 29th, we have to go back to the cardiologist, and we have to go to the cancer center one day this month, I don't know what day. And then, um, need to go to the health department to get Kata a shot for 7th grade. And then I gotta register her for the school that's closest to me. Um, and I hope that goes well, because I, I honestly, God, I can't stand this school. I just, I cannot stand it, and it just, it makes me nervous and has anxiety just to walk inside of it. But, uh, you know. And then, we gotta go to have diabetic shoe fitting on the 9th of August which is another great thing and I don't remember where else I don't know like there's others mom has a doctor's appointment on the 2nd dad has another doctor's appointment on the 1st of August Kata's birthday is the 4th so yeah and I have not planned the birthday yet so I'm just oh my god like this whole year and it's, you know, here we're like half over. And I feel like this has been like the most stressful time. I'm I'm just like, I, there's not been a break. Like June was horrible with my dog passing away after 12 years. And that was just, I just can't handle it. So, yeah, I don't know if anybody else is feeling this way. And then going through perimenopause and emotional and just, yeah, and it's 190 degrees so, and 190 degrees and fat and perimenopause just do not mix. Do not mix, y'all. And being, you know, I'm 49, almost 50. So, yeah, <laughs> this has been a horrible year. But anyway, I was going to a grocery haul and show what I got at the grocery store, but I just, 
I didn't want to. I didn't want to. I just didn't want to do it. I just wanted to get the stuff put up and lay down. And I had to do a little laundry and I just fixed the coffee pot. And I still got a muffin tin in the sink that needs to be washed. It's been there since yesterday, but it ain't happening. It ain't happening. I'm not going to do it tonight. I'm not washing it. Now, it'll lay there. So anyway, that's what's happening. Oh, we got to do school shopping. Oh, I hate school shopping, guys. I hate going taking a 13-year-old girl school shopping. Oh, for clothes. All my boys, when they were growing up, I mean, they didn't care. Most of the time, they didn't even want to go shopping. They were just like, give us some t-shirts and a couple pair of jeans. We're good. They didn't care. Oh, my God, girls. I'm guessing I was the same way, but I don't remember. <laughs> I'm not going to state no claim to it anyway. Anyway, y'all have a good night. I hope everybody has a blessed weekend. See you tomorrow.